Hi everyone, welcome back to Elm Ring. We discovered a cute little village which was filled with people inflicted by frenzy, um, so they didn't have a really good life. Um, but we cleared the camp so far, as far as I can tell at least. We're quickly gonna sit down on the grace, at the grace. I always say on, so if I say on, please forgive me. I know that it's wrong, but it just seems so much closer to um, what we would say in German. So we did find a um, sacred tier, which we definitely gonna use. And now we have plus three already. So that basically increases the um, the amount that has that is been replenished by by using the flask. So that pillar over there that you see, this is where a couple of episodes back we found the map fragment for the Weeping Peninsula. Oh god. Where? Oh, from, oh, all the way over there. Oh my god. Okay. I can't believe. I can't use my map. Is it because I'm in a fight? Does it count as a fight? But I mean... I'm not fighting yet. Okay. Now it's... Okay. Okay, let's have a look. So we have this part over here. This guy is here. So I'm gonna ignore him for now. And we'll have a look at the other side of the map, uh, of the, this, like... ...path. He has really good eyesight, though. Let's get between the... <laughs> Mist. Oh. That's also a spell. Mm -hmm. Releases poison mist before caster. Incantation of the servants of rot. Releases a poisonous mist before the caster. This incantation can be cast while in motion. Those who dwell within poison know rot all too well. The death that begets life that comes to all equally. That is to say, it is the cycle of rebirth put into practice. I wonder... Let's have a quick look up here. Please stop the fighting... Um, music because I'm not fighting anything. Okay. Like maybe this guy. Standing behind him she's like doing things. Him being completely unimpressed. Smithing stone. I'm really scared of this guy. Mm. 
with his huge arrows. That's not cool. Ah! A fucking bear! Okay, he does hurt. He does hurt a lot, actually. Oh, I don't even get something? Oh, this is disappointing. Here. Oh, another one. I'm gonna fight him like a man. a little bit eaten. Give me something. Like, you're quite the rare enemy so far, at least. I want something from you. Okay, where am I? Ah, see, this is the poisonous swamp area. I wonder, though, if it would be better to... Um, to kill... The guy with the um, big bow and arrow first. What is? Uh, because um, otherwise she just keeps bothering me with um, his arrows. Okay, I'm just simply gonna ignore these um, slug thingies because then I have to get off my horse, and I'd rather not. E. Leave your chest close, please. This is disgusting. They ripped their chests open to arrow. Like spill out some I don't know maggots or whatever that is. Voila. Uh, I didn't press that, by the way. Or, if so, just accidentally. You see what I mean with the arrow guy? He's just like shooting at me. Even though I'm pretty certain he cannot see me. But for that he can't see me, he's pretty accurate. Poisoned. I'm not sure what necessarily poisoned me, poisoned me just then. I can only imagine that this stuff hit me. But I didn't see it. And something's also hurting me. No. Do not grab me. My god, just hit him! <laughs> Toxic mushrooms. Eh! What is this? No! I should have equipped, um...
the poison thingies here. I don't know why I didn't. was okay. Grab eggs and super fight flesh. Like, is that the big surprise of this area? Because I haven't seen anything interesting yet so far. In here. He's coming? No. I don't have enough flasks to fight him. Okay, I don't know if... What happens if I go... Can I go up here? Ah, look! There's something. A golden rune. Oh god. I'm stuck. Yeah, well, what am I... what? Are you respawning? Or did I just miss you? Maybe I just missed you. Yeah, so when they hit me... yeah, with this shit. It's poisoning me. I don't know why this is so confusing to me that... Um, I always hit the wrong button when I um, actually want to swap my items. Oh god. What? Wasn't the item just there? It swapped places. Yeah, well, I mean, now I think it's time to fight this guy. Oh, what's there? Faster. Fuck you! You gotta be shitting me. Hey, never. Ice. Oh shit, hey. He is devastating. Um, so the question is, is it just him, or do we have more than... He looks very similar to the dude that we fought um, after we like used the, the teleportation chest. was as good as dead. Oh nice, a golem great bow. That sounds big. Oh, we didn't read this one as well. That's a short bow that we bought in the last episode, I think. Small bow made to fire arrows, or the one before, to fire arrows over great distances, other than its ability to fire off arrows in rapid succession, it is also well suited for use on horseback. Mm. Um, skill barrage. Archery skills using a bow held horizontally. Ready the bow, then fire off a rapid succession of shots faster than the eye can see. And that's the golden great bow that we just picked up. 
Great bow of black stone crafted by a civilization now gone to ruin. Weapon of the Guardian Golem. That's what we just killed. Extremely heavy. This scraper requires enormous strength just to draw, suggesting it was not designed for human use. Through and through is a skill, powerful archery skill using a great bow held in an oblique stance. Ready to the great bow, then twist the bowstring to fire a mighty great arrow that can penetrate through enemies. Strength um, 24, which we're almost at, and dexterity 18, which is also not too far away, so we could technically use it, but we do lack the arrows for that. Okay, how many souls do we... Oh, we have quite a few. I'm not sure if he comes back, though. You know? What is this? The Siege of Castle Morn. A lone hero fights for his vengeance only to fall at the, le the hand of Lord Godfrey. Okay. These all swords? Well, stone swords, okay. Okay, so we are at the castle. I do hope that we find a grace in there. I'm sorry. But you do have quite some valuable resources. Okay, hold on a second. I want to craft something. I think we can craft these ones. Let's get five going. Oh, look. Arrows, arrows, and uh, these are fire arrows. Why don't we... We don't have that many, though. So for one arrow, we need three tiny beast bones. But these ones, same. These are bolts. Okay, let's do... We can only do nine because we then we're out of tiny beast bones. Why not? Um... Let's just have a very quick look around here before we go into the castle. A lily. And then let's cross our fingers that we actually have a grace immediately when we go into the castle. That would be amazing. Also, let me know, please, if I miss something in these like poisonous area there, because it felt a bit strange, almost like a distraction or something, you know. Oh, so we have beach here. Anything of interest? Not really. There's an item. Oh, and then there's... Okay, Jesus Christ, there's just so many stuff. Oh. Okay. Fuck 
fucking hate dogs. Dogs and rats. I honestly think that FromSoft is just putting them into a annoyed player. Seriously. There. Is it still there? Yeah. Nein, bleib da. Are you kidding me? Nein! Uh, <laughs> I didn't switch my weapon! Man! Do they... Hmm. Do they respawn when I quit out? Ah, that was terrible. Okay, let's get into the castle. Let's not waste any more time. I see a grace. What is this? What is this? Is for some no what okay now it's gone Ooh, and we're gonna sit at the grace as well because we need more um everything <laughs> i'm interested in t uh, to see if the golem is back it doesn't look like it Okay, well then, we shall have a look around. It looks like a... like one of those um, Chinese firecrackers. Okay. I mean, Irina already said to us that everyone's dead. Probably. Sorry for that. Just don't want to miss any secret passages or something. There are none. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh god. Yeah, that's definitely a job for my demi humans. Something died. Ah, man, damn it. Shit, no, I have to go back, sorry. I really have to level up. I just saw how many um, runes we have. Sorry for that. We get to 25, so then that uh, this is done. Mm, and then we need endurance as well. Okay. Yeah, sorry for that. I was. <clears throat> I was just so excited to get further into the castle that I forgot that. And it's also, I must admit, um, it is a little bit, um, how do I say, tricky because you don't constantly have the user, user interface. So you have to press triangle to realize how many souls you have and all these things. So if you don't constantly see it, you're not reminded of how many you have. And then you keep forgetting. And this is a bit, I don't know, someone's shooting arrows. It's a bit mean, to be honest. Okay, we're gonna enter this area in the next episode. Hope you enjoyed this one, and until then, take care. Bye-bye.